Hello, this is going to be a quick video on how to set up the bot so that you can place down blocks automatically on r slash place. So the first thing you want to do is to clone this git repository. This is going to be kind of like a technical video um, just by the nature of how it works. So if you know about GitHub or like anything like that, then this shouldn't be too bad. But if you don't, then maybe don't worry about it. Um, okay, so first thing you need to do is clone this Git repository. So type git clone, then paste the link, and then you're gonna log in so that, uh, it might prompt you to log in, and then you gotta, um, it'll download all the files that you need. So then you're going to open the folder. Bruh, this is not what I want. There we go. Okay, so we got the folder open. It looks like they made some updates to this actually. Anyways, what you need to do according to the readme is set up this, um, wait, they changed things on me, heck. Oh. oh, okay. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is to set up this JSON file with your um, all the different things that you want. So it looks like they have it set up to have like two accounts running at the same time right now. So you, what you would do is you'd put your Reddit username in here. So like, for example, mine's CorbinFD. And then you put in like whatever password that you want or like whatever password you use to log into Reddit here. And then the client ID and the client secret you get by going to this website that's on the GitHub page. You come here and you just fill out whatever you want on this and just add some link. So like for my last one, I just added a link to the Discord. So I'll just use that again. And then we'll paste that in and then make sure you select script and create the app. Copy this secret and paste that into here. Um, normally you'd like want to keep the secret actually secret, but in this case I kind of can't. So I'll just like delete this one when I'm done. And then you also paste the client ID from right underneath here. Um, and then the next step after that, I'm just going to delete this because I don't have a second account. Um, if you have a second account, you can just do that. Um, and then for the image start cords, I believe these should be the location of the, um, the location on r slash place where you want to start placing the, the pixels. So if we look here, okay, yeah. So if we look on our slash place here, you can see that like you might want to start drawing like here or here or something. And what this bot is going to do is it's going to take an image that you give it and then it will look and see if any of the pixels are off on our slash place and then replace the first one that it sees with the proper pixel. So for example, for what I'm going to do, I'm going to be starting on 397, 275, and then just only focusing on the block M. So if you go to 397, 275, 
you can in order to like start placing pixels there you fill that in here and then your your thread delay i assume that must be the delay in between if you have different accounts um yeah this can like yeah if you have multiple accounts feel free to adjust that so you don't like get rate limited and then like your timer will increase and then the start chords is where the program is going to start looking on your image that you give it so in this case they have like what the norwegian flag um and if you start at zero zero then it's going to start in the upper left corner but you could also start it like right here for example and then it would only do this part of the image and look and see if any pixels are off there and then fix it so yeah that's about it for that and then in order to actually run this program what well, let me switch over to my actual repository here right here I have an older version of the um of the thing but let me put in my password and stuff here real quick. Okay, so I put in my password and then save the file and now if I just run python3.main.py it should run the file and then start checking r slash place to see if any pixels are off so in this case i start at zero zero and then it's also going to be looking on r slash place in the place i was talking about before so 397 275 so in this case it should fix this pixel right here so we'll see if it just does that unless so i'm just going to rerun the program now and it should like actually be in the right spot um and then yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. 398, 276. That should be better, right? Yeah. So, I don't think it actually had, like, a place available, but that's where it wanted to put it. Um, so, this should work properly now. If you have any questions, just DM me.